We are here in front of Brave Turn doing an installation contract on the Wikinger offshore wind farm which is located in Germany in the Baltic Sea. Uh, now we're in Sussnitz which is the loadout port. The scope for Fred Olsen Wind Carrier on this project is both transport installation and mechanical completion of the turbines and we have our sister company Global Wind Service doing the flying both lift supervisors and uh, technicians to do the mechanical completion. I think both Fred Olsen Wind Carrier and Global Wind Service is bringing to the project a lot of joint experience uh, from previous projects, among those Block Island in the US last year and Global Tech in the North Sea. We have a lot of the key members still on the team and I think that's been a big benefit for this project. Once the vessels arrived in location and jacked up next to the foundation, the first installation phase will be for the gangway to be put down to the TP. Then the TP will be prepped, ready to accept the pre-assembled tower. Once the pre-assembled tower is lifted from the vessel and installed to the foundation, all fixing bolts are then installed and then the torque sequence is started. Then we remove all rigging from the pre-assembled tower, switch rigging from the crane and then hook up the nacelle to the crane. We deal with lifting of huge components, uh, some of them weighing up to 340 tons. So uh, our main priority is to get all our technicians, our subcontractors and all the personnel on board our vessels home in one piece. HSC for us on board Fred Olsen's uh, vessels are number one priority. By keeping the focus several times a day with toolbox talks, uh, we have permit to work meetings, a lot of good procedures that we need to follow. By doing that, we are maintaining a good, shall I call, HSC mentality on board Fred Olsen's uh, vessels. No single person is ever too small to call an all stop on any job we have. If uh, somebody sees something that isn't right, we expect everybody in the company to have this ability to say something's not right and stop all operations. And then we will take five, ten minutes, whatever we're needed, we, we address the situation and then we move forward from there uh, once everybody's happy and the situation's safe. We have a lot of training modules that we go through with our subcontractors, technicians from Global Wind Service before they can do any work on our vessels. Once the nacelle is lifted from deck and installed to the pre-assembled tower, we move on to the rotor star assembly. The rotor star assembly on the deck is stacked on three rotor stars on a cassette. And as we lift it, we've got a tool called the RTT, rotor tilt tool, which turns it into the upright position. And then we're able to slew around and mount the rotor star to the front of the nacelle. The guys in the turbine then obviously finish all the bolting and stretching processes 
and then we have the client come over to do the client walk down to check that everything's been left in a safe state. And the very last piece is the crane goes to bed into the boom rest and then the nacelle is yawed away to the safe state so the vessel can jet down and move on to the next location. Having global windsurf within the Fred Olsen family makes it uh, we can we can sell the full package. I would say the teamwork really good. It's some of the best teams I ever worked with, and they take pride in their job, and also the safety. It's a big thing for them, and uh, they're looking after each other. The guys are great. We understand each other just like family. So, yeah, it's always good to see these guys, and there's a lot of trust in them. So, it makes it easier to do the job. Excellent to be working on this project on this vessel. Excellent living conditions, accommodation, the way we get looked after and a great team. I'm proud to be the project manager on this project. It's a challenging project but I think we're doing well. So the key really of these offshore wind farm installations is a lot of repetitive work. They have long duration and I'm actually quite proud of the team. They managed to keep the momentum up there, keep delivering good quality and even though they're doing the same task over and over again every week. And I am really happy to have uh, such a good team working on the project. Thank you.